Welcome back to our series on the Indian knowledge system in physical sciences. Today, we journey into the world of mathematics in Vedic and classical India. In this video, we will explore the profound contributions of Indian mathematicians, from the Vedic period to classical times. Our story begins with Vedic mathematics, which is found in ancient Indian texts called the Vedas. The Sulba Sutras, composed around 800-500 BCE, are among the earliest texts that provide mathematical insights. These texts were primarily concerned with the construction of altars and geometric shapes, demonstrating a sophisticated understanding of geometry. The Sulba Sutras contain detailed instructions for creating right angles, squares, and other geometric figures, showcasing the practical application of mathematics in ritual and architecture. One of the most revolutionary contributions of ancient Indian mathematics is the concept of zero. The earliest recorded use of zero as a numerical digit is found in the Bakshali manuscript, dating back to the 3rd or 4th century CE. The Indian mathematician Brahmagupta, in his work Brahmasfuta Siddhanta, formalized the rules for using zero in calculations. This breakthrough laid the foundation for the decimal system, which is the cornerstone of modern arithmetic and computational methods. Another significant advancement was the development of the place value system. This system, which uses the positions of digits to represent different values, was first documented in the works of Indian mathematicians. Ayabhata, in his text Ayavatiya, used a place value system for representing large numbers. This innovation made calculations more efficient and accurate, influencing mathematical practices around the world. Ancient Indian mathematicians also made groundbreaking contributions to algebra and trigonometry. Ayabhata is credited with the development of early trigonometric functions, including sine and cosine, which were used for astronomical calculations. Bhaskara II, a 12th century mathematician, authored the Siddhanta Shiromani, which contains detailed solutions to quadratic, cubic, and quartic equations. His work on algebraic equations and their solutions significantly advanced the field of algebra. The calculation of the value of pi and the development of infinite series were also areas where Indian mathematicians excelled. The value of pi was approximated with remarkable accuracy by mathematicians like Madhava of Sangamagrama, who is often regarded as the founder of the Kerala School of Mathematics. This school developed advanced techniques for calculus, including the use of infinite series to calculate trigonometric functions and pi. The contributions of Vedic and classical Indian mathematicians have had a lasting impact on mathematics and science. Their innovations in geometry, algebra, trigonometry, and calculus paved the way for future advancements in these fields. The mathematical texts and techniques developed in ancient India were transmitted to the Islamic world and later to Europe, significantly influencing global mathematical practices. The legacy of these mathematicians continues to inspire and shape modern mathematics. To summarize, the rich tradition of mathematics in Vedic and classical India has given the world some of its most fundamental concepts and techniques. From the concept of zero in the place value system to advancements in algebra and trigonometry, the contributions of ancient Indian mathematicians remain invaluable. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the Indian knowledge system in physical sciences. Leave your thoughts or questions in the comments below, and let us know what topics you'd like to see covered in future videos. Welcome back to our, seri Welcome back to our series on the Indian knowledge system in physical sciences. Today, we journey into the world of mathematics in Vedic and classical India. In this video,